And now, live from the historic Hawaii Theater in downtown Honolulu, here's your host from Hawaiian Music Live. Run away! Aloha, how's it, how's it, how's it? Welcome to another Moonlight Melee concert series on this Aloha Thursday, live from the historic Hawaii Theater, presented by Haka Entertainment, with a big mahalo going out to Sweetwater.com, Aloha Roadway Services, and Hawaii Cell Storage! Gotta love it, gotta love it! Hey, uh, thank you to all of our cross-posting partners as well for their continued support. While you're watching, make a donation, you know, to the virtual tip jar to, of course, preserve the historic Hawaii Theater. Also, to help out our wonderful musicians. And boy, we got a pack house today of incredible talent. In fact, if you guys are ready, let's introduce you to them. The only two-time Moonlight Mele performer so far, I think, on bass, engineer, singer, songwriter, producer, Sean Pimentel is with us. Welcome home, brother. Welcome home. On this side, on the guitar, this gentleman has just received a Naohoku Hano Hano Award a couple nights, a couple weeks ago, for a contemporary acoustic album of the year. This is Kala Ikamarillo. Hello, everyone. Yeah, Hello. give it up, give it up. And of course, right smack dab in the middle. If he was around, like in the early '90s, had this little known band called the Hawaiian Style Band. Incredible stuff. Since then, she's gone on to uh, pursue an incredible solo career. Female Vocalist of the Year, multiple Naohoku Hano Hano Award winner. She's worked with some of the best, including these gentlemen here today. Please welcome Roby Kahakalao. Hello, my Kako. <clears throat> All right. Thank you, Wade, for this beautiful introduction. Mahalo for having us here at the most gorgeous Hawaii theater. And might as well get started. Here we go. And thank you, boys, yeah. for coming yeah. down and playing uh, on this lovely Moonlight Melee. All right. Oh, no, Levi. Why, 
that first skin lady of uh, Molokai, and that was actually the very first, very, very first Hawaiian song that I ever learned when I was still in Germany. From there, we could take you um, to the Big Island, a, a song that Kala'i's cousin, Loeka, wrote. Send this song out to my mother-in-law, Adele, tuning in. If I could be the ocean Embracing all the land If I could be the sunlight That dries up all the sand If I could be the lava That flows to the sea Then I would be they call Hawaii 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 If I could play the guitar Hawaiian songs If I could do the hula I'd do it all day long If I could be a core canoe I would flow myself to sea I guess I'd be the one they call Hawaii Big Island. Beautiful, Kalai. Well, right now we have a special treat for you. Um, she's from Waianae, residing now in Eba Beach. But our beautiful <laughs> Malia Mahi is here with us. And um, yeah, apparently Sean and I didn't get the memo about the uniform. <laughs> I thought it was baby blue. Ka Kala yeah. Kalai and her ca got, got, got the memo about the, the outfit. But we're going to feature Malia on a beautiful song. Um, 
I want to dedicate this to Uncle Books, who is, who is uh, Jerome Coco, that is, from the Maka Hassans, because we used to do that song together and um, had plenty of fun doing it. So here's a song going out to all our friends, a song called My Dear Friend, or in Hawaiian, Ku'uhoa, featuring the beautiful Malia. Beautiful Malia, oh, with all her poor everything. Thank you, Malia. Mm -hmm. Mahalo nui. Um, right now, while Kala'e is changing instruments, we're going to feature Kala'e on the title song of that CD that won him uh, the Naho Kuhanohano Award. Again, congratulations, Kala'e. Oh, I couldn't you. be a prouder auntie. And yes, I'm, I'm not just Auntie Auntie Roby, but I'm really his auntie. Through, um, through the Kalima family and my niece, uh, Polani. Uh, my niece married his cousin, so we're actually uncle and, um, not uncle, ne <laughs> nephew, nephew and auntie, hello, hello, <laughs> no, 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 that's far, he's far from uncle, <laughs> see, I'm trying to push the uncle thing on you, we're auntie and nephew, <laughs> and right now, featuring my nephew on the title song, um, this one's called uh, Feel at Home, song I wrote for the island I was born and raised on, Kalama. island of Maui. I hear the echo of the valley And I feel the cool of country breeze I see the beauty of Napili In the warmth of a key afternoon Where McKenna in your charm When I'm with you I surrender all of long for in my heart Cause I feel at home Oh I feel at home with you I hear the sound of soft guitars And I feel the Kaleakala So I am brighter 
than the stars And I feel the ocean in your arms When I'm with you I find the comfort of my canna in your charm Surrender all I've longed for in my heart Cause I feel let on Oh, I feel let on Oh, I feel let on Oh, I feel with you. What a beautiful song, Kalai. Oh my gosh. Hello. I am so proud to be your auntie. <laughs> and Sean, thanks again for, for coming down here and playing with us. Thanks, auntie. <laughs> You're welcome, uncle. <laughs> All right. Well, as Cousin Wade mentioned, um, I go all the way back to this band called the Hawaiian Style Band, and we're going to do a song that, was, that we did with, with the group. Um, still doing it live, when, when, whatever gigs we do. So here's a something called Nokiano Ahi Ahi. Take you back in time with Auntie. <laughs> One, two. Ooh.
that was um, from the first Hawaiian style band album, the Red Album, and um, I'm actually kind of proud. We kind of got cut off right when we got started again with the COVID thing. I yeah? know, I know. Um, Sean Pimentel is actually the, the latest member of the Hawaiian yeah. style band, and you went from drummer to bass player. Already. <laughs> you're, you're so talented. You can just like like Wade said, engineering, a pro producer, uh, or songwriter. I think because I get fired from every job, then I got to move to the next one. <laughs> no, 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 no. You're you're an extremely talented young man. Oh, thank you, nephew, brother. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, ankle. <laughs> it's anti uncle, ankle. Ankle, yeah, ankle. <laughs> Oh, aunt, auntie, 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 auntie. Antico, <laughs> antico. <laughs> but yeah, so so happy to have Sean. Yeah, so Thanks. about a um, couple months ago, well, right before the, the COVID thing, mm -hmm. uh, Hawaiian Style Band, we decided to get back together. And yeah. we had a couple of really nice rehearsals, actually yeah. went in the studio to yeah. work on, on some new songs. Some and new then, songs. bada boom, bada bing. That this, but we're not the only one, so yeah. it's all on, on the burner, yep. yeah? And, yep. and uh, happening, so yeah. mahalo nui for joining. I, I'm oh. super happy to have I'm, that. that I'm super stoked, yeah. That, that yeah. harmony in there. And yeah, of course, yeah. Kalai and I, we've been, so wait, really quick. The way Kalai <laughs> and I met was so awesome. I was on the island of Maui, and my friend said, oh, I, was, I went there for, for a gig that night, and my friend who we always stay with when we go to Maui, Jared, brother Jared, mm -hmm. Uh, everybody, yeah, everybody yeah, knows everybody Jared, Jared. Roback from uh, from Sprucklesville. <laughs> he said, "Sister, we can in the afternoon. We can do one one quick, just a couple songs for for this uh, this boy passed away in a car accident." I'm like, "Of course, yeah, we, we go." So we went to the celebration of life. Well, he's a fireman, retired fireman. We got there. He started drinking with his friends, and he said, "What's this?" Can do by yourself, and I'm like, oh. That's, <laughs> if you know me, you know that the one thing I don't like to do is play by myself. Ah, gosh. So I saw Kalai and his brother uh, Kamaka. They were they were on on stage, and they were playing for these young kids. They were playing like our Creator Boys. They were playing some of my stuff. They were playing uh, Lihua stuff, since that's mm -hmm. your, your other auntie. And um, but I I had no idea who they were. But I was like, wow, these boys sound awesome. Mm -hmm. So of course I know Shame. Uh, I know Jared was out. <laughs> he was he wasn't gonna be playing with me, so I went up to the to the two brothers, the Camarillo brothers, and said, "Oh my gosh, I only have like five songs. Would would could one of you maybe play with Auntie? Have, have, have mercy on Auntie and play with me." And Kalai said, "I play with you," and and we played together. And ever since said, I I said. After we were done, I said, you know, I normally don't do this, but bro, I can have your number because I like, I, like, I want to play with you some more. And after that, I remember thanking, every time I see Jared, I thank him for... Thank you, Uncle Jared. Yeah, thank you, Uncle Jared, for bailing out on me that day because thank you, Uncle Jared. I ended up with a beautiful color on, on my side. And um, it's, been, it's been going so well ever since. So, mahalo nui. Yeah. Thanks, Jared. Big, big shout out to Jared Robeck. <laughs> we still love playing with you. Okay, well, right now... Speaking of, of, of uh, Sean also, the, the talented Sean, we all know this guy, uh, like I said, we took our creator boys and everybody knows John Cruz and when we go to Maui and stay at Jared's house, we play a lot with John Cruz oh, yeah. and he's definitely an um, incredible songwriter and, and a dear, dear friend mm -hmm. and um, sometimes when John isn't around and Sean is, then we let Sean do this, this is one of my favorite John Cruz songs. And not just because it has two chords. <laughs> I, I just love the harmonies that and helps, everything. Though, yep, helps. But it definitely yeah. helps in my case. Yeah. Um, we, yeah. We're going to feature this brother right here, Brother Sean oh, uh, Pimentel, on a song that John Cruz wrote, a song called Shine On. sun comes through the window on your head I'll find your love and spirit everywhere Well, I may not have that much to give in material things But what I have is this song unto you I sing Shine on Shine on let your light fill up this world till dawn Shine on, shine on Let your light fill up this world till dawn Well, won't that long I wait for you when you're finally here I'm amazed 
got the loving that we both will share Well, I may not have that much to give in material things What I have I give to you so freely Shine on, shine on Let your life fill up this world till dawn World till dawn. Talk to me, Clay. John Cruz sounds. Yeah, never, love ever. you, Johnny. Love you, Johnny. Miss you too. Oh, oh and you know, J Johnny lives on the island of Maui. I know. That's right why I next door, on the same lot, actually, as my niece Polani right. Makamai. Right. I know. I see all the parties. <laughs> I know. It, everybody. So I just I called him the other day, and I called Polani too, and I said, I don't know who I'm more jealous of, her or him, <laughs> her for living next to him or him for living next to her, because she has. Polanyi has two babies, and mm -hmm. I still haven't even seen the new oh. one yet. And not you, to take not to take anything too. away you from you. You seen Nomeo? No, yet? not yet. No, you never got to meet Nomeo. No. Oh, yeah. oh, I thought oh. I thought you guys got <laughs> no, to meet her. No, it was already. all locked down already. Yeah. I know. Yeah. yeah. Not to take away from Polanyi, but. Your other niece, Iini. Oh, yes. She's fire that one. Her videos, <laughs> the, the TikTok video. her videos is Her TikTok videos is on point. Speaking yeah. of that, yeah. she got that one from me, the one. Hey, I only in my 20s. If you call me auntie one more time, I think I'm going to have to invite you for, for supper. What are we going to have? <laughs> I'm, I'm sure all that stuff one. is real life stuff. Oh, yeah. That she's oh, yeah. Doing, yeah. All, all, all of it. Because you and your sister are cool. Yeah. That's, that's all you guys. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Iini get them. She, she's, she's the TikTok queen. So I think Polani and Noe out tuned in. And Paka Ia no veo. Aloha hey, ena pepe. Aloha it kamukuponi o Maui. So Polani tell Uncle John that we say thank you too for letting us sing his song. Mm -hmm. um, we love it. Yeah. Okay, back to the agenda. Wala <laughs> aukahakalau going off over here. We're going to have our beautiful Malia join us one more time. This here is a song that um, I think um, one of the greatest Hawaiian songwriters ever. Mm -hmm. um, Oh my God, Frank, Frank Kawai Kapu Kalani Hewitt, to a blank. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, he's, he's just amazing. There's, there's not one song that uh, didn't make it like huge in the hula world, and this is definitely one of them. The lucky guy that got to record it was our other good friend, Mr. Mm -hmm. Sean Awal. 
and it's a beautiful song. We're going to feature Kalae and Malia in their in their uh, <laughs> in their uniform, in their prom, the, prom yes, attire, in, in their prom, prom attire, Mary Monarch <laughs> outfit, uniform. <laughs> On this song, it's called Kapilina. Beautiful song. Tula, but that's a whole nother <laughs> That's why we play music. <laughs> a whole nother story, yep, exactly. Then you have you have your beautiful porno to dance for you and, and I have our lovely Malia, so thank yeah. you. Mahalo. Yeah, let's Mahalo. not even go into that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, we're gonna do another Hawaiian style band song. This one here and uh, usually it was written by Wade Cameron, mm -hmm. one of the two two main songwriters of Hawaiian style band. Mm -hmm. Brian Kessler is the other one. Yeah. And um, Wade wrote this one. Uh, we called it our wedding song for the longest time because <laughs> that's all we played it for was weddings for the first like year and a half. I, I think. thought you meant <laughs> wedding song like you and Wade. Oh, oh, oh no, oh, no, 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 no. Um, but it, yeah, it, it was a, a big wedding song and still is kind of, I think. Yes. And and Valentine's Day. Yep. <laughs> and karaoke. And, and karaoke. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> so mahalo kalae for for uh, learning the song and and uh, singing it with me. 
Um, we're going to also announce that after this song, there's going to be a small intermission and, uh, and then some announcements, and uh, then we'll be back with another set here at the beautiful Hawaii Theater. So don't go away. Uh, Cousin Wade is going to come back and then uh, a few announcements. Yeah. And here's a song called Love and Honesty. Brown skin, light brown eyes, golden hair from sunny skies, a haunting smile, a fresh peacock and lane. Soft touch, a warm embrace, tears of joy they run down my face. I think of you every single Life changed so fast. During COVID, we've had a chance to think about what's really important in our lives. The arts are an expression of what it's like to be human. To feel, to help us make sense of our world. Does it mean anything if no one sees it? Training and dedication are stronger than any virus. We all need to express ourselves. Keep doing the things that make you happy. So when the lights come back up, we'll, we'll all be ready. ready. 
No more space in the hale. The place is Kapulu. Oh, Hawaii South Storage. The best in value. Plenty room and aloha. I'm joining Arohana. Uncle Jerome and Sadie. We always malama. Hawaii South Storage. For the last 24 years, your nonprofit Historic Hawaii Theater has helped millions of people explore and experience the wonder of music, theater, and culture. From school plays to Broadway shows, from the Brothers Cast to the Beach Boys, we've transported you from Hawaii to the moon and back. Won't you become a member today and help preserve this last remaining historic show palace? Go to hawaiitheater.com. Become a member today. We can't do it without your support. Follow. Sweetwater is the ultimate resource for gear. If you're a seasoned pro or just like making music at home, we have the expertise, the passion, and the gear. At Sweetwater.com, choose from one of the largest selections of music instruments and pro audio gear anywhere. You name it, we probably carry it. And we'll play it, tune it, pack it, ship it right to your door for free. And just to sweeten the deal, every customer is paired with one of our expert sales engineers. So get shopping and get playing at Sweetwater.com. Aloha and welcome back to Moonlight Mele presented by Haka Entertainment with a big mahalo going out to Sweetwater.com, Aloha Roadway Services, and uh, oh, Hawaii Self Storage, of course. And of course, to our cross-posting partners, mahalo. Please, you know, make a donation to our virtual tip jar, uh, help... Uh, preserve this wonderful building we call the Historic Hawaii Theater, and to help out our wonderful musicians here sharing the aloha today. Speaking of the Historic Hawaii Theater, it would be remiss if we didn't bring this gentleman on. Of course, CEO and President of the Historic Hawaii Theater, please help me welcome Gregory Dunn. Gregory, our weekly um, chat. Aloha. Aloha. Here we are again. Oh my good, gosh. good to see you. One week has passed. Another week, Yo. but boy, you guys continue to stay busy here at the Hawaii Theater. We're ramping it up. Yeah. I'll, I'll tell you what. I, when you came in, I'm sorry I couldn't say hi to you when you first came in because we had three site visits with videographers coming in for different live streams that we're going to be presenting from the Hawaii Theater over the course of the next couple of weeks. Nice. Can't say who they are, but it's going to be awesome. Okay. Yeah. I, I did see the newsletter yeah. about something coming up in December. Yes. Can, can, can you yes. shed more light oh on gosh. Gift Thank of you. Aloha? The Gift of Aloha. I mean, um, you know, we are so fortunate that the musicians in our community have been incredibly generous with supporting the theater over the last couple of months. Um, folks like Roby, Sean's been here a couple of times. Kalei, you're, you're knocking our socks off with the smooth, just amazing <laughs> sounds you guys are producing. December 6th, mm -hmm. we have a star-studded lineup. The Makaha Sons. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Hey, you know, it's like Makasa that should be enough she, already, that but should be okay. enough, uh, you know, yeah. throwing yeah. John Cruz. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Amy Hanai Ali'i Gilliam. Whoa. Amy. Love you, sis. Thank you. Uh, Taimane. Wow. He's going to be throwing in with us as well. I mean, okay. We've just got this incredible lineup of people that are going to be joining us to help raise money for the historic Hawaii Theater. December 6th, so okay. mark your calendars. We're, we're totally stoked with this. It's going to be a, a remarkable event. Um, we're looking for sponsors. We have a couple of title sponsors that are coming in at some higher levels, and we have uh, donation tickets available on our website now. And KHON2, Channel 2, is going to be showing up, and we'll be broadcasting live from the theater from 2 to 5 on Sunday, December the 6th. Okay, so part of it is... A telethon type aspect, right? Telethon. So live, you'll be able to call in like the old Jerry Lewis telethon. You know, showing my age, right? Um, you know, where you. Oh, oh, cool. Yeah. I know. Hey, thanks, huh? Thanks, Auntie. You know, used to be, used to be, she called me brother. I'd call her Sister Roby. Now it's Auntie Roby. Yeah. <laughs> Gee, we get them. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so you can call in, make a donation, help support the theater. 
get your yeah. name up in lights uh, and you know help us to preserve this place because we've been without a live performance since February of 2020. Right. So if you think about it, it's it's almost six million dollars so far this year that we've lost wow. just in the calendar year. And if we're not going to be open again to public audiences for most of 2021 is what it's looking like. Yeah. We've all going to throw in and help support this place because we don't get a lot of support from the government. Uh, our corporate support has been lagging because there's so much need in our community. So we're asking folks that care and want to help Kokua us throw in and, and help us keep this place so we can keep going for future generations. Absolutely. Website. HawaiiTheater.com. Got it. T-R-E. <laughs> Dot com. <laughs> the fancy kind. <laughs> Gregory, Gregory Dunn, Thank everybody. You. Thanks, Gregory. Hey, Always Thanks, good talking Greg. story. Likewise. Oh, and of course, we turn our attention to our wonderful musicians. Let's let's break it down first. Let's talk to Sean. Sean, I know you were up in California. You had a few performances there. Yes. Kind of had maybe Shmokai Pilikia getting home, but oh, yeah. you are back <laughs> home. I'm back home, yeah. I actually met up with, uh, with Lehua, who's living in uh, Vegas now. Yes, yeah, So yeah, it was yeah, nice yeah. to be back together. Reunited. And <laughs> <laughs> it was nice to be with her. Uh, we got to do a bunch of gigs up there and stuff, so it's good nice. to be home, though. Yeah, nice, wow. and we mentioned that you were like one of a uh, few that has returned here at the Moonlight Melee stage. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. so I, I think maybe you... Lopafka Colon, oh. and of course, we always have the Makaha Sons. Right, right. It's coming up next week, yeah, but yeah. wow, two timer, man. Ooh, wow. 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 Look, out, look out. This gentleman, Kalae Kamarillo, Maui educator. He teaches elementary school at Kapalama Elementary. Yeah, your alma mater, yeah. My alma mater. <laughs> that's all I have to mention. You're not to mention, but now a Nahoku Hano Hano Award winner. Yes. How does that feel, man? Congratulations. Oh, a dream come true. Dream true. Really? Yeah. So, again, if you don't have the album, feel at home. You got to go out and get it. It is a fabulous, yes, fabulous absolutely. recording. So, congratulations. Thank you. And looking for big stuff from you in the future, too. And, of course, in the middle, Sister Rose. How have you been? I'm, I'm just, I'm so happy to be here today. And, um, like, I've been playing music for so many years now that normally any kind of gig, you know, like, I can eat food until like the minute we go onto stage. <laughs> this morning, I couldn't eat a bite. I was actually nervous about playing because we haven't played in so long. And just just an insider real quick, on Monday we had, we had a rehearsal. <laughs> Thank God we had we were we were forget, and not just me but we were forgetting chords, keys, <laughs> verses, the order of verses. But if if you don't keep practicing and keep it up, yeah. you know you, you do get rusty. So, uh, mahalo to the boys for showing up for the rehearsal because that's something I'm not used to. That the, the the brothers I play with usually ah now we wing them, we get them, yeah, and, yeah, and we yeah, usually yeah. do. But I'm so glad these boys were were up for for a rehearsal at Kalai's house and we had really good fun. But um, and Malia too, with, she joined us for the hula. So I. I I want to just thank these two boys for for giving their time and and for for uh, coming down here to the theater. Because, but it feels wonderful to be on stage and playing. You've performed on yes. the Hawaii Theater yes. stage before, yes. and it's one of my favorite venues ever. Yeah. So, not just that, but but just performing in general. I, I was literally nervous this morning, and just now, just before we went on, I ate some of the some of Yolanda's spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> and thank you. I, not that I lose my appetite. Obviously, can tell that I don't. <laughs> that's, that's why they call it comfort food. Make you that's comfortable. Right. Make you yeah. comfortable. Yes. Well. Would you mind starting off the second half? Oh, we would love to. We go in. Yes. One more time. Moonlight Mele, please welcome back Sean, Kalai, and Sister Roby. Mahalo Nui. And uh, so we're going to take it right from there and start it with, a, with another song from Kalai's brand new CD. Um, this is a song, when I heard the CD, um, it, it got literally stuck. Not, not stuck, but I, I left it in my car for oh, weeks because I just couldn't listen to anything else. It, there's not one bad song on the CD. But there are some songs on there that I'd love to play, but get a little bit kind of fancy chords. When I heard this song here, I was like, oh, yeah. This is what right up my alley. It sounds like a Kao Crater Boy song. You guys tell me if this is not a beautiful song that, that he wrote um, for the island of Hawaii. And I'm going to let him tell you what the song is called and what it's about. So I was born, on, um, born and raised on the island of Maui, but both my parents were raised in Hilo. And Hilo is always my favorite place to go visit because it always rains over there. And on Maui, where I'm from, in Kihei, it's like super dry. So I always look forward to visiting my family down in Hilo. So I wrote this song for them. This one called The Hilo Rain. Yeah. Love this song. <laughs> to wash away. 
mountain calls me I'm going where the rain is falling Falling on the ones who paved the road I chose today I'm going where the people call me I'm going where my culture is thriving I'm going where the music floods my doubts to wash away Kalai song and oh, this guy he already wrote a couple of new ones for, for the <laughs> next album amazing you're just unbelievable so so proud of you thank you and now I just can't gonna see him I can't wait for the radio to play him already <laughs> 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 had to put that one in there okay this one actually they play a lot on the radio they've been playing it thank you to the Hawaiian stations for still playing this song um I'm, I'm amazed at the longevity of, of some, of some of my songs. But I guess if you don't come out with a new album long enough, they, they keep playing the old stuff. So <laughs> mahalo nui to, to all our, our beautiful Hawaiian music stations for, for letting me be part of, the, of the, the lineup still yet. And here's a song, this is still, the, to this day, the only song. I started writing many, many songs, but the, my problem is finishing them and recording them. So um, <laughs> this is the one song that I started, finished, and recorded that I can take credit for, uh, and, and that my sister for most of the writing, but uh, takes us out to the leeward side of this island, um, beautiful place that I still consider one of my favorite places, not just on the island, but in the world, mm. place called Makua. Mm. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> Peaceful is Makua in the evening Above us all the hoku shining bright and Once we're there we never feel like leaving To return to Honolulu City Light So we stay where life is simple and free Where the mountain, the valley, and the ocean Make us realize where we want to be Now white sands and blue waters say good morning as we watch the night, I swim so playfully. They've come with the whales to greet us at 
the dawning of another sunny day for you and me. We lay our nets at the setting of the sun to find it full of ea when the morning comes, and with the uwa koko over us in maku. For this whole island, mahalo e ke akua. Makua, our Aina, the land that belongs to you and me. It's the Puhonua for the Kua Aina, a place where all Hawaiians should still be free. So we stay, oh, we stay. Makua, where life is simple and free. The mountain, the valley, and the ocean make us realize where we wanna be on another sunny day for you and me. Should still be free in Makua on the Mauna here at the theater. Mm-hmm. Mahalo, <laughs> thank you. Yes, okay, well. This next song here is actually a song that my sister wrote. She wrote. She writes all the nice, like uh, she wrote Hepolani Makamai, Kekio Kaaina. She wrote this one here. That was kind of a big thing mm-hmm. with that we recorded with Bada Bula Ia, <laughs> song called Pi Mai Kanalo that takes us out surfing. So I've been playing this song ever since I recorded it in 1995. Oh, some of you wasn't even born yet, <laughs> but um, then w- once I started playing with Kalae, my sister lives in Hilo, and she told me, Roby. Um, you ever, you ever heard Kalai do the song, Pete My Canal? And I said, no. She goes, you know, I love the way you do it, but from now on, when you guys do it, you can't have Kalai do them. I was like, oh, thank you, I love you too, Ku, but <laughs> thanks you, thank you so very much. And then I heard, then I, so the next time we, we played together, I told Kalai, Okay, my sister's been raving about how you do Pete My Canal. And I said, can, can you, would you mind doing it? And he said, oh, no. And he did them, and ever since then, I'm like, Kalai, Hit it! It's your song from now on. And this way, I get to do my favorite parts, which is, which is the Fiji parts. But yeah, Kalae does such an awesome version. He got all his, all his tools and, and pedals over here. So we're going to feature Kalae on a song that my sister wrote. But Kalae is her favorite version now. So. <laughs> and, and my niece too. So everybody that hears Kalae do them, they totally agree. Like, oh yeah, definitely should have Kalae do it from now on. So you be the judge, but I'm sure you'll agree. Kailohe ia mai oa o Pii i ma 
kanalu ti mai kanalu e he kanalu ga ko ai ma ka pui na kai na na lu nui mai kai ki mai ai ma ka pui na kai na na lu nui mai kai ki mai pi i mai kanalu pi i mai kanalu kai lo he i mai o o pi i mai kanalu pi i mai kanalu e he kanalu job so i'm sure everybody agrees from now on it's kalai song <laughs> <laughs> thank you well 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 ladies and gentlemen so i i just said my sister is my sister kuka hakala wait dr kuka hakala that is <laughs> she's the one that writes all these beautiful hawaiian songs like keki o kaina pi i mai kanalu um song she also wrote songs for makaha sons but she wrote this one here um i remember when she first wrote he polani makamai that's the her, her second daughter's uh, name polani makamai and um she said i wrote this song for the makaha sons and then she was going to give me another song the why olo o y p o and then when i when i saw polani makamai i said no 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 that that's our baby girl that's my song i want that song so the sons can have the why olo o y p o which also turned out of course what else can you expect a beautiful song but um then Polani Makamai was mine, so I I took it to Moon and, and Jerome, and I said if if they would you know do me the honor of singing this song with me, mm. and um, the song, it's my I always say my 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 sister's ingredients for a song ingredients that is, uh, is low and slow. She likes everything low and slow, <laughs> so she she sang He Polani Makamai for me, and it was already beautiful. And then I went, um, like I said, I, I handed it over to the sons, to the Makaha sons. And um, when we went in the studio, I'm almost going to tear up now. Uh, I heard the arrangement that Moon and Jerome put to it, and I was just floored. I was like, oh, my God, this is going to be the most beautiful song ever. And it, to this day, it's always going to be one of my favorite songs. And we just so happen to have Mr. Jerome Coco in the house here. He said he's underdressed. Uh, brother, you could be naked. I wouldn't care. You, you just come up here and sing care. with us. I would care. <laughs> and, and, and put your beautiful voice on this melee with us. <laughs> I, I love you. Thank you so much. Thanks, Pita. He's, he's going to join us. And um, we did it in soundcheck earlier, and I, I had to hold back the tears. And... Um, on top of that, we're going to have... See, Malia going to cover all us guys, so no, no, need, no need worry about our slippers. But we both get slippers, so, so no need worry. But main thing, we get... Your yeah, but look at this. I look so boro boro over here. No, no, no. You look just <laughs> oh fine. Look at you. If I knew I was going to be on stage over here, at least I would have... <laughs> 
<laughs> put on my shoes or something. Like that. Look, At least I, you have a collar. Look, I get slipper. Yeah, I get yeah. slipper too. Look, Uncle Sean. Uncle Sean get his. Uh, his uh, um, what kind of shoes is that? Brother? Vans, the Vans. Vans, yeah. yeah. Well, so That's about two hundred dollars. Two hundred dollars, and Tita over here get her the kind. Her fake, uh, her fake the kinds. The Louis, Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Louis Vuitton. Oh, okay, let's make them oh, real. Oh, the Louis, let's make yeah, them real. the Louis Vuitton. That's another four hundred dollars. <laughs> and what kind of shoes is this, bro? Ross. Look, look at that, Ross. Yeah. Oh, yours are just like mine from Ross. Two, two ninety nine specials. <laughs> Mine is from the Philippines, so never mind. <laughs> the Louis, mine is the, not, not Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, that one. <laughs> I have the, I'm, I'm wearing the Louis Vuitton today. Oh, thank you, Tita, for inviting me so, on oh, stage. So thank, thank you, thank you so much. The third, right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and and um, we're going to have Anna Kala Books or, or Mr. Jerome Coco join us on, on this song that um, I think made it into what it is because of the Makahasan. So... Thank you for joining no, us. Mahalo oh, Nui. how Thank beautiful. You. Thank Mahalo Nui. So here's a song called He Polani Makamai. Oh, and of course, the beautiful Malia. We gotta, gotta let her get onto the stage. <laughs> Oh, the fondest, fondest memories of all our <laughs> adventures and uh, good fun. 
laugh till you cry kind. <laughs> yeah, there was never a dull moment with uh, people like Uncle Books, uh, Dennis Pavao, <laughs> Uncle John, <laughs> Uncle John, yes, on tour. Oh my God, heaven, <laughs> heavenly memories, always, always good. Okay, ooh, Fort Fred, yeah, yeah, <laughs> oh, that's right. I'm just gonna put a band. Um, right now we're gonna. When, so when I first heard Kalae play, I thought, oh, he sounds so much like. Um, the, the style him and you and your brother had was reminded me of Kao Crater Boys, and you did a lot of their stuff yeah. too. And you're doing really good, and your voice uh, kind of reminds me of Ernie. Mm -hmm. um, I don't think there's anybody that can say we don't miss Ernie. And, and oh, no. pretty much not a day goes by that somehow something makes you think of him. And mm -hmm. uh, no, who <laughs> like <laughs> all, all his little shenanigans. And uh, just uh, we miss you plenty, Ernie, yeah. but. We know that you're up there in the big band, and the band is getting bigger mm -hmm. and better. And mm -hmm. um, sometimes I'm like, "Ooh, I'm almost ready for go, <laughs> for go join the band," because right. there, there's some serious, serious uh, talent up there. Mm -hmm. And um, but back to Kao Creator Boys, we're gonna do a song featuring Kalae. This is a beautiful song that they recorded. It's not an original, but who, who is this by originally? The uh, the Orleans. Orleans. Orleans, yeah, that's the one. So we're featuring Kalae on on this Kao Creator Boy. Um, memory and um, hope you like this one. <laughs> we've been together since we back when and sometimes I never want to see you again but I want you to know after Still the one. Love that guy. Yeah, 
<laughs> Love that Kyle yeah. Crater Boy song. Never, never gets tired. <laughs> oh, well, we've come. Uh, we did uh, Love and Honesty earlier, and then there was another duet that was almost at the, uh, right around the same time that I got to record with a good friend of ours. Everybody loves Brother Jeff, and mm -hmm. Jeff, I always say, um, has so much guitar credits on, and even backup singing on, on, like incredible how many albums he's on, and and. Uh, and I don't want to say he's underrated, but he's definitely one force to be reckoned with oh, out yeah. there. Brother Jeff Rasmussen, um, we love him. Right mm -hmm. now, he's he's very serious about the COVID, and I totally understand. He lives with his mama, mm -hmm. and uh, and mama is is a kupuna, so um, got gotta be gotta and, and and I don't think there's anybody in the world that loves his mama more than Jeff loves mm -hmm. his mama, mm -hmm. and uh, rightfully so. She's a treasure. She's an angel. So Jeff, you my mama, you mama, and mm -hmm. we love you for it. And but everybody misses you, <laughs> misses you out there on, on stage because people say, "What happened to Jeff? How come we not know hear him?" Well, and then I tell him he's he's taking the COVID series, and rightfully so. So we love you, brother Jeff, um, and we of course we love you too, mama. And um, we're gonna do this song here that Jeff and I got to record. I got to record on Jeff's CD, I should say. Rainbows End is a song uh, that was done by Stevie Nicks and Don Henley, mm. and it goes like this. Forever, 
Thank you, Brother Jeff. We love you. And I miss you too, even though you're on island and doing fine, but miss you, miss seeing you and being close to you. Mm. Well, folks, um, we're almost at the time where um, we're going to play our final song. And um, I don't know if, if wait, we didn't cover this earlier. We get one Hannah Ho stash, but this is going to be our official last song, but in case Wade calls a Hannah Ho. But before we sing this song, okay, I wasn't going to do this, but I have a friend in the house here. He's, uh, he's very dear to me, and if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't look like this. Eric, come over here. Please, <laughs> come over here. You can leave your mask on or whatever. But this is my friend Eric. He's he's been with me. He's right here, and he's he's responsible for hair and makeup. And he's just my dearest friend. <laughs> he he. This is totally. He did not expect this, and I always mention Eric because um, he's not just a special friend, but he's also. This is the third year he's a heart recipient. So he's um, he's a very very special person in general, and just. Um, It, it makes me so happy. Like, he hasn't seen Uncle Books and, and, and Yolanda in, in years, but for him to still just be around and, and make my life a happy one, um, I thank God every day that, that you're still here with me in my life. And thank you for, for my beautiful lay and hair and makeup. I, you're, you're my bestest friend. And we want to also, Malia, come one more time. We want to thank Malia one more time. If she's gonna, if we do the Hannah Hall, she's going to come and dance again. But we want to give a special mahalo to, again, Malia for 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 joining us on the hula so mahalo nui malia of course uncle books oh my god it it was amazing singing singing polani makamai with you thank you thank you i love you and um again sean and kalae you guys amazing thank you i always say if um if i was if i wasn't so um surrounded by great musicians and and great voices and great friends I don't think I'd play music because I don't like playing alone. I mm. hate it, hate it. <laughs> and that's probably why I don't practice and why my fingers are smoking burning right now. <laughs> but um, we're going to do this this last song. Sean said, Ruben, you, you should do the last song, but yeah. we're going to do this together here. Yeah. This is a very powerful song um, that Skippy Yoane wrote um, a, while, a while back. In fact, uh, I don't know, I'm really bad at math, but it was in 1978. So you guys do the math. But uh, we're going to feature Sean and Kalae and I guess myself mm -hmm. on this beautiful song uh, that Sean did some some new version, some new vocals on it, which I really <laughs> love, which they make the song contemporary. Mm -hmm. But we want to thank everybody. We want to thank Hanale, Kaanapu, mm -hmm. and everybody else who's who is uh, sitting in the crew here, the Hawaii Theater for opening their doors and, and the stage to have us here. Mahalo, mahalo. And for those of you watching, yes, um, If, if you're able to, which I know a lot of us aren't, but if you're able to and in a position to help Kukua and keep this place open, it would be one of the worst things that could happen to the island of Oahu and to the state of Hawaii if Hawaii Theater couldn't open its doors anymore when mm -hmm. they're back ready to be opened. So mahalo nui. Our loss, uh, nowhere near six million, no worry. <laughs> but, but us musicians, we've been uh, out of work since, like you said, since March. So mm -hmm. we're, we're going through the same thing, but not nearly at the level that you are. So wherever you can give uh, mahalo nui for, for, for your puvai, for your generous donations, and those of you who cannot, who just watching, We totally understand because we're in the same position, so no <laughs> worry about that. But mahalo for supporting Hawaiian musicians. It's beautiful to see how we, we support each other because that, that's been a, a thing that I've been watching on Instagram. You know, every, all the musicians, we're all in the same, <laughs> in the same position. So, uh, and mahalo for, for everybody coming together. And like we said, we're in this together and we can get through this together. Yeah. So mahalo nui. And thank you, Kalae. Congratulations mm -hmm. again to our Nahoku oh, Hano Hano Award winner, Kalae. <laughs> what, what a beautiful thing, so deserved. And mahalo, Sean, mahalo, the, the, the expert in everything, in, <sighs> in, in studio, in recording, in engineering, in producing. Mahalo. You're, you're awesome. Mahalo, And we go mahalo. way back to, Olelo, to Papa Olelo Hawaii. Yep, yeah. He used to be my kumu. Yep. 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 Oh. Your auntie, auntie kumu. Yep, yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, enough talking already. We're going to leave you with this one here, something called Hawaii 78.
Ladies and gentlemen, Moonlight Mele, of course, put your hands together. Clapping emojis, please. Sean Pimentel, Kalei Camarillo, and Sister Roby Kahakalo. With that, 
Hanoho. Oh, see, I can, I can hear them. I can hear them and I can feel them. Right on. Hey, before we go and bring them on for their one more song, I want to remind you, join us back here next week, Thursday, for another great Moonlay Mele. It's the Makaha Sons. With that said, Hanoho, Sean Pimentel, Kalai Kamarillo, and Sister Roby Kahakalau. Mahalo, wait. Mahalo. Mahalo. Yeah, I also want to say mahalo to Donard yes. and Mike yes. and Gimme, yes. all those guys, Haka Entertainment. Everybody. Uh, everybody here. Mahalo, mahalo, yes. And um, again, mahalo, Uncle Books, for, for the Polani. And mahalo to Yolanda for the food. Oh my gosh. Yes. Mahalo. Oh, my gosh. oh we, us Hawaiians, how quick we forget. <laughs> mm -hmm. But we're going to be back for round two right after this. And mahalo for letting us to Ahanaho. Um, we, we get to call Malia one more time uh, to join us on yet another Kawai Kapu Kalani song, Frank Kawai Kapu Kalani Hewitt. This one here, um, he wrote a while back. It's a song called Kawai Lehua Aala Kahonua. <laughs> Melenu 